Welcome back everybody to another Minecraft video. So today we're doing a quick tutorial on how you can find emeralds in your Minecraft world. So the reason you never see emeralds when you're mining around underground is because they only spawn in a specific biome or a specific set of biomes or type, um, which is the mountain biomes. So this was formerly known as Extreme Hills. So in all the older versions, I think past like 1.12 maybe, um, mountain biomes were known as Extreme Hills. And um, that's where you could find emeralds, but they changed how, how uh, mountains and the biomes generate and stuff now. And there's more variants of each mountain. So there's about seven or eight types of mountain um, variant of biome. And each one you can find emeralds in. So there's like gravelly mountains, gravelly mountains plus, wooden mountains, snowy mountains, taiga mountains, that kind of thing. You get where I'm going with this. Basically, as long as the biome has mountains in its name, you can find the emeralds there. So as you can see, I am currently in the biome, Minecraft, gravelly underscore mountains. So we can, in fact, find emeralds here uh, because it has mountains in the name. And this will work for literally any uh, biome that has mountains in its title. And yeah, hope that explains that at least. So your next mission, once you find yourself a mountain biome, which has mountain in the title, as we discussed, um, you need to actually get down to Y level 11, and that's where emeralds are. The same as where diamonds are found on the rest of the Minecraft world, uh, emeralds are found at Y11 in mountain biomes. So, usually when I tell people to go mining for diamonds or different resources down way underground, uh, I would recommend going in either a staircase pattern or uh, going in going through a cave system to find the ores themselves. Um, but... That really won't work here because it's a lot of gravel. Like, as you can see, I'm on a gravelly mountain right now. And if I was to use a pickaxe to get through all of this gravel, it would take me about 10 years. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but it would take me a very long time. So what I'd recommend is getting a diamond shovel, right? So they say never dig down in mine, never dig straight down in Minecraft. So you're going to do this, okay? This is a strategy I've picked up over the years. So what you want to do is you want to get your diamond shovel, right? Or not even diamond, just any kind of shovel that you want to use. Uh, the fastest one you can get, preferably. Um, but basically, what you want to do is you want to mine one block to the right, one block to the left, one block to the right, one block to the left. And once you get to stone, switch your pickaxe, repeat the process and um, just keep doing it the whole way down and this way if there's things under you you will not um, fall down straight into the lava or whatever it is or cave system that kind of thing you will stay on this block here so if you mine this one you can see all of what's below you you're good basically and um, you won't uh, fall off because you're on this one you're all safe and you can mine this one and even if there is lava under that block you're still safe because this one will guard you so say there was a lava bucket here or a lava pool or whatever right there uh, you'd still be on this block so you'd be absolutely safe from any falling or anything like that so this is a very effective method for getting straight down quickly and i'd really recommend it for these mountain biomes because as you can see we are at y level 97 so that means you have to mine through about uh let's see 86 blocks to actually get down to y11 so you can uh, find your ever precious emeralds so literally just keep mining down in this method and uh, put a torch down every once in a while just so you can see what you're doing and make sure you have resources to get back up if you need to because this is a one-way ticket down really unless you want to build all the way back up which is a lot of effort so literally just keep doing this the entire way down uh, make sure that you just keep following this method do one at a time don't just go like bam 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 because that can end badly if you just kind of mess it up literally just keep doing this one and you'll be safe the entire way down and I know people say everything straight down in my Minecraft, but we're breaking the rule today so yeah keep going all the way down until you reach y level 11 in your coordinates gui and here we are at y level 11 so there's two possible things you can do here you can listen for a cave i've gone over this in my how to find diamonds video in the past um, but what you can do is you can listen for a cave which i can currently hear because there's bats and water sounds which means there has to be a nearby cave system and if you hear lava that's also a good sound just basically any ambient noises around you means there's a cave system nearby and you can try mine into that and try to explore the cave system and that way you can probably find emeralds or you can literally just go in a uh what's it called it and uh, a mine shaft pattern you can literally just go straight in front of you like this and i put a torch in every once in a while just keep going but one thing i'll guard you of when you're actually mining in a straight pattern like this in a mine shaft um make sure when you're uh, mining to check f3 every once in a while just to make sure you're in the mountain biome because if you mine out of the mountain biome underground you can't really tell um but if you mine out of the mountain biome you won't be able to find emeralds because you will be in a different biome altogether and they won't spawn there so just make sure you're in the mountain biome okay so we've actually stumbled upon a cave system here so we can quickly just kind of adventure around this thing and um yeah let's see if we can find any emeralds real quick and there we have it so yeah 
This is actually at Y level 20, which is interesting. So emeralds don't necessarily spawn right down at Y level 11. They can spawn up quite a bit, actually. And um, they're not like diamonds. Diamonds, you need to be very far underground to find them. But with emeralds, it's a little bit more straightforward. They're kind of more common. But the thing about when you find emeralds is they only spawn in veins of one every time. I don't know why this is, but whenever you find emeralds, you'll only get one or per, uh, per find, basically. So you'll never get like a cluster. Like with diamonds, you can get a cluster of them. Or the same with iron, you know, any kind of ore like this uh, you can get clusters of them same with gold but with emeralds you only find one ore on its own which is kind of sad but i mean it's understandable because you can get a lot of emeralds and trade them with villagers so yeah the method is literally to dig straight down using the whole um one in one method i showed you so you go literally uh, in between the two blocks and then just go one 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 that kind of thing until you get to y11 and uh, once you're at y11 dig in a straight line uh, this way until you hear some cave noises and then try to dig towards that and if you get through the cave all well and good if you don't just keep digging a straight line you're about to find emeralds eventually just make sure you're still in the mountain biome when you're doing so you can check over here you can see we're currently in the gravelly underscore mountain biome and we found the emeralds over here because we stumbled into a cave system and this cave system happened to be very very good so if you can't find any um emeralds by mining a straight line try to find a cave system and the cave system should help you out a bit so hope this is of some use to you uh people who want to find emeralds because they can be quite useful especially in 1.14 with all of the new uh balance patches to villages and trades and that kind of stuff uh, emeralds are now a key part of minecraft once again so so thank you guys so much for watching this video if you did enjoy please make sure to leave a like and subscribe uh, there is a playlist down in the description where you can check out more of these tutorials um they're pretty detailed and they go through step by step how you can do a lot of stuff in minecraft and i like to think that they're pretty useful to most people so hopefully you'll enjoy most of those videos but that's gonna do it for this one so thank you guys so much for watching i will see you all in the next one take care